We Garamansians have lived and thrived in the north of Africa for many years. Yet though we are strong, there are those who would threaten our hard-won security. Centuries ago, Rome came to our doorstep, displacing our neighbors and snapping at our heels. Though we have exchanged some pleasantries since then, they nevertheless exist where they should not. However, their control is wavering. To the north, the Huns and barbarians demand their attention, which leaves their African holdings vulnerable. We could make great gains here and reclaim the coast. Yet be aware, we are not the only African people who would gain from conquering imperial territory. We must be quick and decisive in conquering these lands. The Garamanshan claim is strong and our will even stronger. Beyond Rome is the world. And should the Garamanshans not aspire to such greatness? Go forth in our name and seize glory. All right, everybody, welcome. This is Havoc. In part one of our Garamansian campaign. I thought I would try it out. Uh, this will be a Tuesday, Thursday campaign. Um, and I, yeah, I thought I would just see how they do. Um, this will be a half hour, just FYI. Literally just testing out to see, um, see how everything is. We're going to go ahead and secure this guy's loyalty. So yeah, the Garamanchians, let's see their traits. Okay, so we are, what are we? We are Semitic Pagans. Which means we get replenishment plus five with all armies. That's pretty good. Desert Kingdoms, we have plus two sanitation, immune to desert attrition. And plus 15 melee attack during desert battles. Fortunately, we also have fractured faith, faiths which means we have increased public order penalty for religious differences between new religions and as a desert power. We get plus one irrigation fertility bonus, minus 50% conversion time on the main building chain, and plus 15 morale when in owner allied territory. So these guys are pretty legit. They seem legit any excuse me anyway, so we automatically start out with only knowing the Eastern Roman Empire, the Gaetulians, which we're sort of on par with you the and the Western Roman Empire which we're at pretty even technologies wise uh, what do we want to do horde growth public oh they can be a horde interesting recruitment cost minus five percent we're gonna go ahead and go infantry quarters this unlocks recruitment of desert spears which replaces desert I levies will. these are desert levies as you can see, we are gifted with quite a few r range of cavalry from the Ginnico. Very light melee, very light melee, very light skirmisher. And uh, so I think we should probably just go ahead and get rolling, huh? So we're 16 out of 20, so I really don't want to do anything there. We need to focus on sanitation. As you can see, we're at minus one over there. But we really don't have the ability to go in there and do anything just yet. Religious intolerance. I would imagine that's probably a decent ways away. Oh my. It's a very long ways away. Right there. So we're into tier 3. We won't get there for a very, very long time. So what we could do is we could recruit another army. We have our pick to choose from. Kind of pick of the litter. Relentless Attacker. I'm going to go ahead and raise this army because he's young as well. Uh, we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. I'm kind of thinking we could attack the Garamanchians. What strength ranking are we? We're strength ranking number 6 in Gaetulians. Did I say Garamanchians? I meant Gaetulians. And the Gaetulians uh, are strength ranking 30 something or another. Uh, what are you, a statesman? Statesman. We'll go there. Still assign a provincial trait and edict. Um. Da, 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 um. 
We could do that. That'd give us our sanitation. Let's do that. Everything else. And that's really nice. So is that. But we'll go and do that for now. We'll see how it works. So yeah, again, this is a Tuesday-Thursday campaign. Um, I figured I'm pretty much just a Total War guy right now anyways. Uh, so might as well do it. They are the free faction. I didn't buy the Slavic unit or the Slavic faction pack. So obviously I'm not going to do any of them. And we'll just see how the Garamanchians do. Loyalty secured, plus three loyalty. Awesome. Gaetulians in the Western Roman Empire. Edict issued. So he is in the positive now. Uh, we are at 50 food. We could do a village. Let's do it. That sounds like a good idea. But what I'm gonna do... Um... Never mind, he won't make it anyways. But we do... Never mind, we do need to. We get minus 15 for one turn, but that's okay. I'm really gonna play it kinda cautious. I don't wanna go to war with the Western Roman Empire right off the bat. I feel like that would do bad things for us. We may just sit and camp for a little while. I don't know, it depends. I could probably actually bump down my taxes just for a little bit. And by doing that, I could, uh... Potentially get in the positives. There we go. Okay, so what can we do here? Public order, ammunition plus 5%, minus 10% recruitment costs. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and go here. What does this do? Nope, I don't want to do those. Oh, we could get. Oh, wow. Desert Legionary Defectors. Very nice. Those are some heavy-duty troops there. And then Camel Warriors and Camel... At your command. Whatever they're called. Um, and we can now upgrade these guys to Desert Spears. That's very nice. Very nice. Doesn't really cost anything. Um, you... Five hundred and ninety-two just for one more public order is not worth it. We're gonna bump that back up. I need to hire a scout next turn. I need to be able to see what they're doing. Since they're at war with the Western Roman Empire, the Gatulians might be very much open for attack in their hometown. It's nice not seeing anyone, because that means our interns are very, very quick. You. We fight for you, my lord. Ready um. I can sweet double agent, builder and conspirator. A man has many faces. A man has many faces. A good winter, that's good. Agent recruited. Indeed, he's been recruited. Three more turns, and we'll get a little boost to wealth. Um, but mainly, public order and growth is what I'm after. And the turn again. Again, our goal is to get to the Gaetulians. See what they're doing first. It'd be nice if we could take them out on the very first, very first episode. I also mainly want to take out the Gaetulians because that completes this whole province. Imperium has increased. Awesome. We could hire another merc or another uh, spy. Oh no, we can't. We just have the ability to. We now have centralized authority. We're going to bump it down to trade customs. 
That's your we're gonna bump you all the way up here. Still can't see him. That's all right. What does this do? This gives us oh, that's giving us a lot of wealth. Okay, we won't do anything then. Hopefully, I'd like to get what do we we need spices, so we'd have to do a food trader, which isn't a big deal at all. It'd give us a lot more food, which is something we're kind of in need of. But we will see. We will see. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Western Romans. Be on the lookout in the next, uh, let's see, the Ides of March, I think is what, the 15th of March? Ebdonians, Moarians, um, because as soon as they release anything on the, uh, whatever they're called, the Vampire Count, sorry, I was just drawing a complete blank there, then, uh, we will definitely... Definitely be doing a video on that. And by we, I mean myself. I talk in weird personas sometimes. There we go. Okay, so as you can see, they are at war with the Western Roman Empire. But, uh... Yeah, they got a pretty big army. And I am not in the position right now to where I can... Uh, enforce anything because of public order okay so we're just gonna look at the the foggy wastelands of Africa I guess is there anything underneath there like is that actual that is it's like actual texture and stuff you can see a sand dune there a sand dune over there that's pretty cool Completely random, but pretty cool. Political gain. Um, yeah, we'll block the promotion. You may be my heir, but you still gotta go through the system, bud. Okay, what happens when he leaves? Minus three, I can handle minus three. And it looks like he's getting taken care of already. My hands are yours. Took out the African Separatist King. Hopefully, well, whoever takes out Dimity, I'm going to take them out. Regardless, so... Y'all bicker and fight all you want. I need to see the faction traits of the Gaetulians. Because if they would make good satrapies or client states, that would be very grateful. So those guys are probably pretty weak. Faction destroyed the African separatists. Disrepute. Spain's reputation is prop, prop. A little bit tarnished. There we go. Make haste, man. Um, what do you do? You can do a mercenary onager. We might do that next turn. I don't know what I want to do just yet. I do know I want to assassinate him. This guy's good. Um, authority, because I'll give him a higher success rate. Uh, we'll go here. We're doing okay. Could be doing better. Again, my focus is on the Gaetulians, so. At your command. Dum -ba -da -ba -dum. So these are a pretty low-key tribe, I think. I mean, that's basically what they are. They're just a tribe. But uh, I don't really know a whole lot about them aside from the fact that. You know, they were a pretty prominent faction in Africa until the 
Roman Empire came in and kind of just pushed them out to the outskirts of civilization. But because of that, they obviously don't have any desert attrition. They don't have a lot of very nice positives. Okay. Uh, okay, so blinking nothing. That's awesome. We fight for you, my lord. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and recruit you. How may I serve you? That's so, I want to assassinate you. Critical success. See, I'd hit, I'd get Dimity's garrison in there as well, and I really don't think I can take all of them. At your service. So instead, At your command. I'll raid a little bit. March. Go out here where they At can't one. reach me. We could actually hire another army we wanted to. They could do a handler, scholar. We'll do a scholar because it gives us Ready some research battle. rate. It's a great and glorious there we go. To fight for our cause. That might help level out the public order, if anything. This episode may not be too terribly exciting, mainly because I don't want to go to war with the Roman Empire just yet. So I'm going to focus on ways to sabotage the Aetulians. And that's pretty much my objective today. For this episode. Cinemus. Cinemus. Some interesting names. I don't really know that I've ever conquered these areas. Novatia in the Eastern Roman Empire. Rank gained. Ready for orders. Good job, Lod. Do I have anything for, let's see, construction costs and recruitment costs, authority, melee training. Let's go here. And then has um, faces. Hinder army misdirect. I don't really think that'll do anything. Oh, may I serve you? They will trouble you no longer. Killed him. All skills improve with practice. Here we go. Let's do it. Besieging settlement! They got nine turns. We could do it. And four turns until they run out of None supplies. It's all right. We've got plenty of ammo or plenty of money, and look at that. They're at plus one. Nice. Amania Stabarco. Amania Stabarco. Okay. Uh, gather intelligence. Scout ahead. Exploit corruption. Extort. Ruin provisions. That's what I want. So we'll meander our way down there. There's a very good chance that they will attack me. Which is fine. I think I could take them. Hopefully I have superior skills against the AI. We'll just have to see. Non-aggression pact. Those we consider to be friends. Sure, I'll take it. I need money. I'll betray it. I don't even care. I mean, I would have to wait ten turns, but whatevs. Okay, so we got... Hmm. We are running a little low. Fall Let's retreat back. and see if they come after me. Binding shelter. They are. Okay. That levels the odds, though. Evens the odds. Whatever it's supposed to be. Uh, I think we could probably take them, though. We have more, one more unit of cav, a couple more archers. Is that even deployable? So we could force them 
to come at us, right? We could. And I'll use you as a flank attack. You guys will get back. What I do need to do is use these guys, rather than go offensive, I'm going to use them as defensive since they have so many cav. I'm trying to think of what I should do though. I could kind of force them to go this way. This gives us, doesn't really give us an advantage, but it takes away their advantage. You know what, let's go up here because we can go... We can go all the way over there. So let's focus on capturing this hill. Okay. Start the battle. And then get you guys up on the hilltop. Reinforcements. Where are their reinforcements at? Okay, they're over there. Who's with me? Even if we could get up here. Waiting on their reinforcements, they may not or they may move right away. Nope, we're just gonna go right down here. Uh we'll go heavy shot. And we'll actually move around here. We'll flank them this way. Get my general up behind him. So many cav. at me, bro. We will darken the skies. Come over here, boy. Heavy melee, there's their desert chieftain, so that's a, a general. Go over this way. We are at your Our general is being attacked! Keep him alive! Steady. Let's do brace. Enemy general is dead. Go here, quickly. I said quickly. Okay, so our spears have routed. One needed spears, though. Uh, let's get archers on these guys. This guy isn't going to route easily. Now we need to get out of there. Each of these individual units can take out the whole. Take out those desert tribesmen. Oh, don't route, don't route, don't route, don't route. Oh, please don't route. Come on, if we can take out this guy. This is a nasty, nasty battle. I knew I was outnumbered from the get-go, but... Come on, General, don't route. General, no, 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 sir. 
men are losing. My men have given up and are running for their If you guys lives. could like actually run, that would be really, really nice. It's one of the most disgusting battles I think I've had. I mean, technically, I have the advantage. But it won't be for very long. And now... All of my... My keyboard seems to have stopped working. I gotta probably get a new keyboard. Not probably. I do need a new keyboard. So it looks like we're going to win this, but it's not going to be by a whole lot. Worry about those guys. They're losing decisively, so that's good. Go after those bowmen. You're gonna go after the desert spears. How many have we lost? We've lost, oh, a good two-thirds of our army. But they've lost more, so... I guess that's a positive. go here too. This guy is just on the verge of wavering. There you go. Kind of solidified your morale. Get this guy into the mix. Why are you wavering? You shouldn't be wavering. Desert levees, okay. We might still be able to salvage this. I would actually rather do flaming shot on those guys. Get those desert spears. Hopefully we can break them pretty quick. Hopefully we can break these guys pretty quick as well. I would think with that cab charge they would be completely exhausted and willing to die. There we go. Okay, we're out. Oh, that was a nasty battle. Victory! This is your day. Oh, we're gonna super fast forward time. I am not gonna get my general in the mix there. Go over this way. Focus on killing those guys. We lost just about a, just a little over half of our army they lost everyone so that's good um, as soon as they're dead that should be the end of the battle there we go Pyrrhic victory indeed 924 that's rough that's rough and they had 126 remaining so we can actually uh, take their replenishments. He escaped, I believe. Yeah. Of course, he hires mercenaries. Enemy killed in battle. 
Imperium. Whoa. That was a little weird. Non-aggression. Military investment. We developed specialized culture cultivation. Yeah. Then we're gonna get certificate certificate and seals. Ready for battle. Of course we can't get anything because he destroyed it all. Critical failure, that sucks. Ready for orders. Um, let's go here. Attack! Uh, yeah, we'll fight it real quick. Just real quick, like, we vastly outnumber their cab now, so we are going to go full-blown offensive. And then we'll see if we can't snatch these guys before their garrison army gets there. Don't want you to be locked. Go here, I'm gonna move you up. See if I can't scare them a little bit as well. There's their reinforcements. They got, what, two units of cav, three units of cav, one of them being their general. Fortunately, that levels the playing field just a little bit for them. We can take on these very light skirmisher cav. No. Okay. Our men have given up and are running for their lives. For glory. They will lose that engagement. Enemy general's been killed. Nice. We will crush the enemy with our greater numbers. You guys will go here. Let's super fast forward time for a little bit. Yeah, they're kind of stuck. They're screwed. Okay. All I care about is getting those desert chieftains, or the desert spears. be good. We still lost quite a few people. I mean, we lost a third of our army. Decisive battle. Decisive victory. Uh, 
Uh, we will take that replenishment. And we will occupy. Which is very nice. Kind of puts us out there in terms of not being able to get that guy, but that's okay. Uh, we will repair, repair, gem deposit. That's in our building queue, so we will leave that there. Plus 40 gemstones. All right, guys. Well, that will be the end of the part. Uh, we did what we wanted to do. We conquered this region. And uh, the Gaetulians are on the run. And we now have the entire region of the Sahara. So, if you like this part, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to see me continue with this again, I'm, you know, I'm just testing the waters to see whether or not it's even worth it. Uh, if you liked it, uh, let me know in the comments, and I will for sure keep going with it. Um, and this will be a Tuesday, Thursday, possibly Saturdays if I can squeeze them in. Uh, but no guarantees on the Saturdays. Uh, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook. Thank you guys for watching. This is Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace.